I'm just thinking to myself, huh, I've done some pretty dumb stuff while drinking too. Not this dumb, but dumb. But then again, I look at it and I'm Dude, like, man, oh, no, no the fuck you did. <laughs> Nigga, no, you did it. I don't think I react. <clears throat> I don't think I reacted to this nigga page before though, but shit, this motherfucker got 10 mil, so shit. And uh, why the hell? Where that motherfucker go? Why the fuck? What is Kai doing on here? Did Kai pass? I might look at these. Let me know if y'all want me to look at these too. But back to what the fuck I was for the look at. Is Nalaya's boyfriend loyal or not? We'll just call him Z. We set up an elaborate plan to get Z to this home to find out if he would be willing to cheat on his girlfriend with our decoy Tessa. Shit, he got to the crib. That's all he all that's it's nigga, he at the crib. Nigga, he cheated. <laughs> what the fuck is you doing at the bitch crib? What? You gonna leave me out here? I wanna prove it to you. Are you gonna join me? Before finding out whether or not Z that passes shit this weak, test, man! I gotta see how we got here. Motherfucker better be soft or something, cuz ain't no way. Ain't no way. Motherfucker gotta be soft or something. Two days ago, oh, she we had an alliance convince Z to pick up an iPad that understand. she supposedly bought off Tessa. Hello? Look at hey. the bitch head, bro. No, cuz. This is Tessa, Nalaya's friend, the one she bought the iPad from. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up? She just wanted to make sure you were still coming by later today to pick the iPad up. Yeah, I'll be there. Okay, sounds good. Tessa texted Z to meet her at this nearby park. We made our way there 30 minutes before their scheduled pickup time. Alrighty, guys, we are in position and we are now just waiting for Z to you arrive. You and she don't and hurt? With the 10 to 15 minutes, I want to say. Z ended up taking a lot longer than we thought, but eventually he finally arrived. Hello? Oh, she's jumping on the phone here. I'm gonna oh, really? fake her dumb oh, ass out. You. Fuck that okay, iPad. She's looking around. Oh, I see you. You're on the other side. Yeah, I'm here waving my hand. Oh, oh there you go. Is that him? Yeah, that that's, him? yeah that's him. Oh, man. He is Look here. at this dude, you bro. You don't get no ass, bro. This, bro. this is if what you do? I mean, I ain't gonna knock it. Shoot, you getting, you getting the bag. But go crack, look at this nigga, man. Go crack something, cuh. And the Raiders fucking suck, nigga. Looks this way, just duck, Stop. okay? Yeah, I'm trying to hide. Windows are tinted, you do you rainbow or something? something? Hi. <laughs> Nice to meet you. I'm Tessa. And Let's do like something new on your channel. And you need to get Reggie Cullen. You guys don't know is that Tessa has Dude, also asked Z to do her doing. favor. By the way, didn't Alaya tell you about the other thing as well? The, um... By like giving you a ride to sell cars or something? Yeah, is that still okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah I, I don't mind. How far is it from you? Like 10 minutes. I'll give you gas money and everything. All right, cool. Bitch, better give yeah, you gas ready. money. You see, Tessa's posing as a flipper. Bro, why are you keep showing this? Some trading cards so that she could plant her jacket in his car. Nalaya paid you, right? She, she gave did. You all the money? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Are you still cool with uh, taking yeah, me? Yeah, yeah, I can go right now if you want to. That would be amazing. I can give you the address. Okay, he's taking her. He is taking her. All right, we are in business. We are in Shit, I would have took her. I would have took her. The bitch asked. I ain't for to do nothing. Shit, I would have said, bro. I just took her to the store, bro. What the fuck? Put my stuff in your back seat. Bitch. So with that, Tessa removes her backpack and her jacket and places it in Z's back seat, exactly like we wanted her to do. I'm crying just thinking about this. Oh, where you, you're crying? No, don't cry. <laughs> They might drive past What's us. What's up with so the moans, uh, though? Put the camera stay down, low. just kind of duck. Yeah, stay low. <laughs> okay. Yes, sir. Hey, hey, they are headed your way. They should be there in about 10 to 15 minutes. He only calls whenever he needs something. Why does he just call to be like, hey, how are you doing? Everything is good. This is pretty much phase one. We are now in phase number two. This nigga face pissing me off, bro. What's up, I don't guys? think I can watch this nigga no more. Today I'm going to be some Pokemon Honestly. cards. Or as some like to call it, cardboard gold. I need to find a side hustle now because Sergio isn't willing to give me a say King Vine Or as some like to call it, as my name is Ken, today I'm going to be purchasing some Pokemon cards. Or as some like I'm to call it, King cardboard Vine. gold. I need to find a side hustle now because Sergio isn't willing to give me a raise. So I, I wonder if Ken knows that I make more than him. Usually I ask a friend to come with me, but like I said, they're all busy. Yeah, of course. So are you like trying to get rid of the stuff you don't need anymore or what? No, this is what I actually do. What do you mean? Uh, reselling things. I go to thrift stores, garage sales, eBay. Oh, bitch, what, what, get is a job. Good that? Is what I would have been thinking. Okay, I'm not gonna lie though. Ken's looking pretty buff today. Damn. I don't have any trust for him right now. I've caught him in girls' DMs multiple times. He's very friendly. 
even around like people I trust. Every time I try to talk to him about something, he's always blowing me off like you're crazy. Shit, come to me then. I'll treat you right for a couple of months. No, I'll just play. I'll, I'll treat you right though for sure. Shit, you know. Okay, here she comes. Excuse me, are you Ken? Yeah, yeah. Hey, what's up? Oh, hi, I'm Tessa. From Offer Up? Yeah, I have the trading cards. I've never caught him with a girl, even though he's like texted girls. I've never caught him with somebody. Mm -hmm. But when I bring it up, he says he's totally clean. I mean, what if these girls are really like just his friends? I don't think they are. The way he'll text them, the way he acts when he gets around them, it's just, it's not friend-like. Oh my gosh, you have stealing the plans? Where did you get stealing the plans? Ken doesn't strike me as a trading card type of guy. This looks fake, exactly. I don't know. Exactly, I would've been, been like, like, hold up. I would've been like, what the fuck? Knowing me, bruh, how, you know, I be paranoid sometimes, so I get to looking around. I would have spotted dude ass in the coffin. I would have spotted that shit. He better be behind some tents. Only way I ain't gonna see him. Only okay, way. No, no, I see it. I see it. I just wasn't sure. So on a scale of one to ten. He would have like got, his ass would have got spotted too, boy. I thought he's gonna pass the test. I would, I would say like a, Four. Oh wow. Yeah. Really? I feel like he just goes for anybody at this point. Have you ever considered just like breaking up with him? I have, but I don't know. Yeah. Girl, be free. I can't do it. What? Those are Pokemon cards? Um, no, um, they're different trading cards. Bro, what the hell kind of cards are these, man? Cause these ain't no damn Pokemon cards, bro. They're like off-branded Yu-Gi-Oh cards. You can just text it me, headed your way. Okay, perfect. Okay. They are headed our way, bro, so they bro. should be here. You Eventually, Z and Tessa made their way bro. back to the park. Oh my god, he's literally you parking. You look dumb as spot. fuck, bro. <laughs> bro, quit shaving that yeah. shit, bro. Oh. Thank you so much for everything. Yeah, no problem, I got Here's you. Here's $20 for gas. Uh, <laughs> trust me, I don't need it, thank you. No, please, take it. In case you guys forgot, the whole yeah, point bitch, of all this was dude. to get That's Tessa to plant her jacket in Z's car. You see, we needed a way to get Z to come to Tessa's supposed home. And what better way than by getting him to return the jacket that Tessa forgot in his car. Did she leave her jacket? Did she yeah, leave yeah, it? she didn't Perfect. have it. I would've said, hey, get your motherfucking jacket. <laughs> hey, get your jacket. We ain't leaving shit in here. Uh, I ain't trying to pull back up. We're good. Woo, we're set. We're good. And just like that, we had a reason to get Z back for phase number three. You forgot your jacket. What? You forgot your jacket. Oh. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> God, he told her to get your jacket out of my car. Hey. They're supposed to put that motherfucker on, plans, on the floor. It appears that her plan is ruined, but she the reason I'm laughing is because it's not. With Tessa's jacket being so poofy, I figured that there was a high chance that Z might notice it. So we ended up planting some AirPods that Tessa would drop as a backup plan. Did you tell me you dropped, you dropped the AirPods, right? I did. Okay, okay. good. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> I told you. See, something literally told me. What if he notices your jacket? The only downside of having dropped the AirPods is that Z's going to get a notification on his iPhone telling him that someone else's AirPods are traveling with him. I mean, honestly, I think we'll be fine as long as we could pull off phase three and like... Then I would have thought she's trying to backdoor me, but I ain't got no iPhone. So shit, that shit ain't got... Well, I got the little app, so that shit is going to pop up on my phone, nigga. Okay, next two days. I agree. He'll just Android basically know that he has your AirPods. Nigga. We it. can get so anything, nigga. Or call you up and say, hey, you left your AirPods in my car. If he does do that, then just tell him, hey, can you think you drop it off tomorrow or the next day or whatever? And we'll go from there. This is it, this is it. How are you feeling? I'm nervous, but I'm ready. Okay. These headphones are for you so that you could listen in to like what's being said. Okay. We were now in phase three of our plan. Tessa had texted Z inquiring about the AirPods and after some strategic and cunning messages on her end, Z had agreed to drop them off at her supposed house. Man, I'm so spotting the fuck out them I cameras. <laughs> Come on, bro. Do motherfuckers better be a camouflage? No. Really? Yeah. You think that means something? I'm hoping it doesn't. Yeah, he might have just thought it was irrelevant to bring up, you know? Yeah. Or maybe <laughs> from genuinely. Yeah, I want me to start reacting to the uh, 1v20s. Some time, Z finally texted Tessa that he had arrived. Oh. 
Here we go. Hey, park in the driveway. Yeah, come on. Now remember guys, Z only came to drop off Tessa's AirPods, so convincing him to park in the driveway was one step closer to convincing him to come inside. We don't have, unfortunately, a live feed of the driveway, but you can I still I would have been right. touching on yeah. my blade. Hey. The blade don't work? Well, I have the poppy, oh, I'm sorry. Oh my God. With the AirPods now in hand, all Tessa had to do was convince Z to come into the house. What are you up to tonight? Nothing really, I'm just chilling. Just chilling? I have plans with one of my friends later on tonight, so. With I, a friend? What friend? You don't know. Maybe I do. I mean, it's possible, but I doubt it. <laughs> Did he just say her? I swear he just said her. Did he just say her? I have plans with one of my friends later on tonight, so. What friend? You don't know. Okay, this was pretty crazy. Z said that he had plans with a her later on tonight. Now he could just be referring to a friend, a family member or something, but being that we're pulling a loyalty test and that later on would it be like 11 p.m., we had our doubts. It honestly really sounded like that, but to be honest, I couldn't really hear if he is hanging out with a her. Like who's her? You think he's referring to you? No, he's not referring to you because he literally just told her you don't know her. Who is he referring to? Who is her? Well, come inside. Come hang with me. Come inside? Yeah, come have a drink with me. Have a drink? You can just have one drink. Come inside. Okay, what are we gonna do? Tessa succeeds in convincing Z to step inside for a moment. In doing so, she is now one step closer to making This hot nigga's die. Welcome to my home. <laughs> yeah, do you live here alone or do you live with your family? I actually live with roommates, but none of them are home. I mean, Tessa managed to convince them to come inside. You don't know anything about like someone that he's hanging out with later on tonight? No. Could it, it be his mom? Could it be his sister, cousin, a good friend? No, mom. he didn't tell me anything. You want something to drink? What is that? It's a mixed drink, vodka, and OJ. You got anything else? Yeah, I have cranberry juice. Yeah, I'll take some. How strong do you want it? Not too strong. I'm not trying to crash. That <laughs> shit <laughs> weak as hell, time. boy. I'm yeah, not. Come on, bro, UD, bro. If you was to ever try to loyalty test me, bro, at least have some shit that's back there. I promise you, I'm passing the loyalty test. You bring me some shit with this player creation, bro. Honestly, bro, I'm I'm a hundred percent honest. Yes, we do not condone drinking and driving. Do not drink and drive. Despite the fact that Tessa was on her way to making her move, now she got a bag and I'm broke. Well, I'm trying not to like. I failed. <laughs> Maybe there's an explanation. No, cuz oh, hell no, no cuz. I tested to try to get it out of him. This yeah. motherfucker ain't gonna let me do <laughs> that, cuz. And so with that, we coordinate a secondary plan. Cheers. On top of making her move, we now wanted to test it to find out who this mystery girl that Z is planning on seeing tonight is. Sense it. I'm sure she'll read my text soon enough. If she doesn't read it soon, I'll like literally keep texting her and stuff. Okay. It actually took a while for Tessa to pick up her phone and read my messages. You see, on top of making her move, we wanted to know if Z would be willing to go back to the room with her to, you know, do stuff. So Tessa was in full on character, breaking the ice and trying to make everything come off as natural and as realistic as possible. Do you want a refill? I'll leave you taking another one though. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, and these, they're getting another one. Bro, oh, bro. Damn, not good. Cheers again? Yeah, cheers. Dude. So how is it this time? <laughs> Better than last time. <laughs> Why does it taste stronger? <laughs> you really want me to stay, huh? You yeah, maybe. <laughs> Do you want to get comfy? Go Nigga, back to the fit couch? ass. I ain't okay. worried this Tessa shit. Tessa spends another 10 minutes 20, doing 16. her job, but she still doesn't see my text messages. So I decided to just get a Nike tech, phone. man. Did she respond? No, she hasn't responded. Big no, ass jumpsuit. She's going to read my message, but I don't think she'll reply. I think she'll just like see it. A hundred text messages later, Tessa finally sees my messages and instructions. Let's see what she can get out of him. So, um, you said you're gonna hang out with a friend later on tonight? I was supposed to. You're just gonna ditch me? I mean, I guess I have to. What's this hangout all about? Who's this person you're ditching me for? <laughs> I told you, it's just a friend. You said it was a her? Yeah, what? Well, Who is this her? I promise you don't know. <laughs> Yeah, but sounds more like friends with benefits to me. I would have been like... Because I question everything. So I've been like, why you ask me that all of a sudden when you look at your phone? It's what I would have been thinking in my head. I'm always a step behind, and I love playing, and I'm going to play stupid. I'm going to say, what you talking about? I don't even remember saying that. 
Oh man, I was just trolling. Yeah, I was trolling. I was just talking Wait. shit. I was doing I mean, it to make okay. it like I was cool. You don't Hold to I'm gonna go home, play the game and shit. <laughs> so what makes you say that? I just know. <clears throat> so uh, what do you guys normally do when you're together? Um, adult stuff. Adult stuff? Yeah. What does that mean? <laughs> I don't think you want me to tell you. <laughs> bro, I'm not you telling guys, no like, bitch what I'm doing to another <laughs> freak, bro. We Are not here for that. No, I'm not jealous. You keep bringing her up, though. I just don't want you to go. Why? I want you to stay. But I gotta go. Can I ask you an honest question? Yeah, what's up? How long have you been seeing her for? A couple of months. Wow. Yeah, that's a long time. Yeah, why? <clears throat> I don't know if it's the alcohol talking, but you're super attractive. Thank you. You fine too. <laughs> and stay. I don't think I can do that. I don't know, she's gonna get mad at me. Why are you so afraid of her getting upset? I'm not afraid, I mean I I just I just have a good time with her, you know. Okay, and you don't think that I can do that? I don't think you can. Mm, you're wrong about that. I don't think you can. I definitely can. No. You, you can? I'm pretty sure I can. Are you sure? Yes. Prove it. Really? Yeah. For a second, it seems like Z was about to turn down Tessa's offer, but he just asked her to prove it. Something she as a decoy would normally ask him. You a freak, huh? You freaky? Mm-hmm. No, you're not. <laughs> How would you you're know? You're freaky, because I've been with multiple freaky girls. Yeah, you gotta prove it to me though. So, what's up? <laughs> I can't even, I can't even listen to it. It's arguable whether Z has failed or passed this test, but I think it's pretty safe to say that he's talking to another girl on the side. Like he's more worried about getting her upset over Nalaya. There's still one last step to this test though. Remember, we gotta see if Z's willing to go all the way with Tessa. Well, let's do it then. We'll do what? What do you wanna do? What do you wanna do? You told me let's do it. So what are we doing? <laughs> no, you tell me. It's your house, not mine. I don't even know where the bathroom is. <laughs> where are you going? It's my room. For what? Are you gonna leave me out here? I mean, you said you wanted me to prove it, right? You, you want me? Fellas, if she throwing it that easy, bro, bruh, do not go for it, cuz. Unless you've been working on this little... It, the only way you do that is if you've been working on this little shit for a minute. You've been texting this little shit for a minute. Cause, you know what I'm saying? That easy. I don't want it if it's that easy, bro. Especially if I'm not even trying. Now, if you try, it's different. Like, say if you meet her and you actually trying to... You know what I'm saying? And she throwing it. Damn, I'm going to catch it. But if I'm literally chilling, like, I'm not even on that, and she steady throwing it, it's either you trying to set me up or give me the pack, or you really just trying to crack, get cracked. It's really a gamble. It's a roll of dice. It's one of the three, bro. It's one of the three. You trying to backdoor me, bitch. You trying to give me that pack, and hopefully it ain't the forgive unforgivable pack, or you really just trying to get cracked, you know? So, shit, you got to roll the dice, and which one is it? And for him, <laughs> he's getting set up. <laughs> Dumb ass <laughs> nigga. I would have been like, man, what? I wouldn't even have brought up no other freak to no girl. Who the fuck does that? Bro, you niggas need to, like... I gotta start giving out lessons to you niggas, bruh. Are you gonna join me? I don't be on that no more, though. Yeah. No. Oh, you sure? <laughs> yes. Are you sure? Then, yeah, sure? then she's drunk. So I most definitely wouldn't have did nothing with her unless she was my girlfriend or I had already performed. Know what I'm saying? That's the only way I'm going to crack on a bit that's uh drunk. If I'm drunk, 
if I already cracked or if she my girlfriend. The only way I'm a crack. Okay. And most of the time, I don't even like performing when I'm drunk. Because I'm scared I might release this <laughs> and don't I'm remember. Gonna, I'm going to make a smorgasbord. Right. I'll be right back. You said gonna, what, why you came here today? You just going to leave me again. Right. I'll be back. I should have listened. So in the end, Z decides to step into the room and have a Look good time with Tessa. Boy. Now I really want to know your guys' thoughts. Do you guys think Z passed or failed this test? Personally, Dude. for me, I'm a little conflicted because I think it's bad that he went into the room, but I can also see how alcohol played a role into that. Not trying to give an excuse for him, I'm just thinking to myself, huh, I've done some pretty dumb stuff while drinking too. Not this dumb, but dumb. But then again, I look at it and I'm Dude, like, man, only no the no fuck man. you did. <laughs> Nigga, no you did it, bruh. Dude, you be quit lying, nigga. No, you did it, bruh. No. So if anything, he's only buzzing it. He's not even drunk yet. So did the alcohol cause this? I should have just listened to everybody when they told me about him. But instead, I took his side. He's such a liar. Do you want to walk in there and she him and tell him everything that's happening? Do you want to? I want him to know. You she heartbroken, man. The girls they be heartbroken recovering is the perfect girls, bro. They fuck the best. Um, uh, they 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 uh, they let you crack with vengeance. They letting all all the anger off and shit, you know. Um, uh, I wouldn't say they more nice. They naggy as a motherfucker. They more cautious though, and they will question everything. So dealing with a girl who's heartbroken, it's a task, bro. It's a task, cuz on God it's a task. But when you performing and shit, it's gravy. You know? Sometimes she you could be performing on her and she probably thinking about dude ass. <laughs> she, I'm thinking about how I just got up on cuz. Thank you. She. Thank you, but thank you, black. I'm up one oh three more and I got a ring and I sweep Thank you. I'm for the sweep the home boy. I'm up on the three oh right now. Yeah. And walk in that room and please him. So like what if instead of Tessa walking in there, you walk in there? No cameras, no nothing. You walk in there and you see what he says. Let's do it. You wanna do it? Let's do it. Then you walk please him. So like what if he's expecting literally Tessa to come back right now? Yeah. And walk in that room and please him. So like what if instead of Tessa walking in there, you walk in there? No cameras, no nothing. You walk in there and you see what he says. Let's do it. You wanna do it? Let's do it. You feel safe going in there by yourself? I mean we'll be here watching and so if anything happens, we're running in there, you know? Yeah, I feel safe. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. And so with that, Nalana decides to confront her boyfriend about everything. I hope you guys have your talkies for this one. Bro ain't asked where the bathroom's at where he walked out. I mean, I don't do that sometimes either, but sometimes I would just to check. Ain't no niggas in here. Because you guys already know. This shit's gonna be You guys already know. This shit. Better than old girl shit for sure. I'm crying. Scum be good. Where'd you come from? Where did I come from? Yeah, Where did you come from? Why are you here? Why are you here? Stop. What? What are you doing? Stop. What do you mean? What Why you are you from? here you in Tessa's here? bed? How can you be here? Can you just tell me? I'm tired of you lying to me. Like I know. I'm not lying. You haven't even let, let me speak yet. You're not You're saying anything. Right, You're not talk. saying Are you anything. Are you gonna let me talk? Go ahead. Tessa? Ooh. I, I just said one word. You're over here talking about. Atia, you always cutting me off. Let me speak. I haven't said anything. Why are you here in Tessa's bed? Just answer the question. Can you I can't speak? tell me anything. Can I speak? All you can say is, can I speak? And then when you do speak, you don't say any words. She is drunk. That nigga trying to have time to come up with some more shit. <laughs> nigga, your reaction time sucks, bro. Right you can't now. come up with nothing. You, you have been, you've lost. You have, you gotta accept defeat. If I can't come up with shit that quick, bro, it's over. I lost, bro. She's tipsy. I ain't even gonna she talk. Had a bunch of shots. 
and I dropped her off home. When I dropped her off home, I came here. She said, "Okay." She, get, she offered me a drink, okay? Mm -hmm. And I and I took it. So how did you end up in her bed? Because I'm too drunk to drive home. You're so full of shit. You're such a liar. You lie about everything. I've lost so many people because of you. Tessa. I've lost so many things. How come Tessa can. Tessa, you know no, what? Tessa, Tessa you know can what? hear you, right? I know Tessa. everything. Tessa. I know Tessa. everything. What's that, man? Oh my God, bro! I can't, bro. What is this? You know, you've been caught. Oh my God! I knew something so, like this was gonna happen, bro. This no, entire no, thing the was fuck you did tested. it. So your girlfriend wanted to find out if you were truly loyal to her or not. So she wanted to set up a loyalty test. So we had Tessa basically ask you on a date, pretend to be into you, all yeah. that stuff. Are you serious? So this entire thing was basically a loyalty test. Oh. I didn't cheat on you. You guys hurt. I just sat I've down heard it there. come out your I mouth. Like, yeah, aren't, aren't you drunk? Aren't you drunk? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Why are you smiling? Why are you laughing? Don't blame Tessa. Blame Wait, yourself. You see this drink? Blame yourself. I was literally, literally drinking. I literally drank my two of these. Bro, it's over, cuz. Oh, it's you've been caught, bro. You just gotta leave, bro. I swear to God, if I see cameras, I'm not for the explain shit. I'm gone. I'm, I'm. I mean, I only had two drinks. But nigga, like, drink. I'm gone, boy. Because we're not gonna send you. We're not gonna send you home drinking and driving. You know, like, it's over. No, you're not. You're not riding with me. No, you're not riding. I'm drinking and driving. Thanks, but like, are you gonna drive? Because if not, we can call you an Uber home, dude. Because we're not gonna send you, we're not gonna send you home drinking and driving. You know, like I mean, you have two drinks. No, you're not. You're not riding with me. No, you're not no, riding. Here, with me. anything will call you an Uber home, dude. No, they will call you an Uber. I don't want you. We're done. Let's let's call you an Uber here. Come here. Come here. No, let's don't talk. touch me. Bro. Let's come here. Let's talk. I swear, don't touch me. Where are you going? Where is this? I haven't even been in here. All right. Oh my God. What is this? <laughs> All right, bro. Damn, Come here, bro. Come on, come on. We, it's, time for, it's time for you to go, dude, or it's time for you. We're gonna call you Numer Home. All right, you're gonna regret this. Watch. I'm telling you. You're gonna regret this. Uh, What's up? No. Oh, my God. No. 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 All right, dude. Hey, I can't tell how much of you is really drunk, dude, or are you, are you fucking around or are you really drunk? Don't touch me, bro. Are you really drunk or are you fucking around? Yeah, yeah. So he told me you're gonna regret this. He's gonna go to old oh, girl. What's up? What's up? Nigga, you ain't drunk, bro. Oh, God, bro. It kick in that quick. Fuck out of her, man. Two drinks. You, you literally only had two you shots, dude. Hey, come, come on, girl. Fate, don't touch me. Two Kill shots. Her, I ain't Nalaya. bad. All right, you're going to kick that. Nalaya. Oh. Bro, relax. Stop, 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 stop. Let's go, let's go. Hey, stop. 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 Yudi okay, is huh? not holding me back, bro. Oh, God, he not. You want this to happen? You want, you want us to do this? Oh, this fuck come no. On. You sure you want to do this? I take both of you. Fatality. <laughs> I don't know how it got to this point. Nobody was helping me. I was clearly struggling. Ken just watching, cameras just filming. All while this man is throwing it back on me and taking advantage of me. Come on, I'll take, I'll take both of you. All right, chill. Chill, I'll take both of you. Chill. You want the smoke? You want the two? Honestly, like, look at that got it down. It looks like Ken's the referee in this freaking fight, bro. He doesn't do jack shit. <laughs> He's just walking around and just like, all right, all right. Chill, chill, chill. That's all he does. You want to go somewhere? Chill, chill, chill. You good? Bro, we're going to let you out there. Shit, not funny, dude. I'm over here. Oh, shit. Give me my key. 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 I honestly couldn't tell if this man was really drunk, if he was acting, or if he got caught and he started acting dumb. I don't know what it was. It seemed Nigga, like is this, to stage? this guy's brain just kept switching. He switched from one girl to the next girl, then he went from calm to violent, and he went from violent back to calm, and then he just walked out. <laughs> I don't know if that was the alcohol or if that was just his brain. That's what I get, man. That's what I get for making sure that he doesn't go home drunk. Man, that's why you gotta be like black dude who do this shit. He got two security guards to handle that little shit for him. Yo, dumbass. I would have beat you? your ass in that house. Where the fuck were you? Is it over? <laughs> <laughs> Man, I hope y'all enjoyed this cut. I'm gone. Uh